Sure. Hey guys, um, looks like the parts came in for the Arduino bike. Um, this is basically just going to be an unboxing. We'll take a look at the parts. Uh, the problem is these aren't pre-assembled, so it's going to take a lot of soldering with the um, extra fingers to get this thing together. So we'll start with the... Actually, I should be putting gloves on for this. I don't want to cook them yet. This will be the GPS. That's the antenna. Now the antenna and uh, some circuit in the back. And this is the actual GPS itself. And there should be... There isn't. This one didn't come with any pins. Oh, interesting. Uh, that's what basically what it looks like. Uh, the Adreno, Adreno, and what do you want to call it itself. Ended up getting two of them in case I cook one. Now I managed to find the packages for both of these, for the uh, LCD and the uh, and the computer to go on the bike. It's so bloody small. And when I'm done, this should operate uh, the GPS, which will show my speed in kilometers or uh, miles per hour, and it'll have a switch on it to turn the bike off and on, and it'll be um, MOSFET loaded. Hopefully, I had the code for it. This one we don't happen to open. This is just a spare in case I blow one up. The LCDs. They're nice enough to include wire with that. Now these are a little small. But uh, we'll see how it turns out. I don't know if I got the right size or not. But you definitely be able to... It's, it, it's old lead, so you should be able to see at least two numbers on that. And uh, it'll be clear once I pull the... Uh, Pull plastic off the back, and it did come with pins. And then I got a spare one here just in case I blow one up. And instructions: the the one here uh, for the um, GPS. They give you an address to download their code. I don't know if you can see that or not. One of the cameras. That's about it. Like I said, we got extra parts here. We got other projects on the go, so. Um, once I get these uh, pins all soldered up on the on the uh, computer itself and on the LCD, we'll uh, do a part two and uh, put it on the breadboard and see if we can get it to power up. Later, guys.